Here's the last video of the trilogy for our section on accompanying. We are now at page 19. We're learning Cradle Song. This is written by Franz Schubert, who was a, class, a late classical composer, and he knew Beethoven. Or, he knew of Beethoven. I don't know if they ever met in real life. So, for this one, we are now in 4-4 four, four time. And this is a very nice accompaniment. It does include accidentals. Once again, accidentals means notes with either a flat or a sharp written in front of it. Please become acquainted with the flat and sharp before playing this piece. So let's go ahead and clap and count the rhythm in our lap. It's pretty simple. Here we go. One, two, three, four. 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 Four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Make sure you practice that in one measure again. Let's try it again from there. Measure number eight. One, two, three, four. 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 Release. Okay, so our chords, once again, are pretty simple. Our left hand consists of these two notes here. And the right hand, once again, in the bass clef, consists of these types of chords. The F and A third, and then the E and B flat, which is not exactly a fifth, but more of a diminished fifth. Okay, so let's go ahead, and once you become acquainted with all of these chords and their proper fingerings, let's get our hands in ready, in position. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, 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 release. Alrighty then. Now it's time to play with the metronome. Let's try it again at 70 beats per minute. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. played through with our counting and then with our the metronome, it may be a good idea to play through the melody to hear what it sounds like. Maybe you want to play through it with the accompaniment or with the metronome. Play through it to listen to what it sounds like and then we'll have it ready for our next lesson. Good luck.